shop your heart out, leave with nothing, feel the love. Go into a shop, feel, feel the pieces, it's more tangible and actually donate it. As a charity, we started three years ago just as a, a group of friends trying to raise a thousand pounds and take a van full of donations over to Calais. We work uh, across ten countries across Europe, the Middle East and now the US. We uh, focus on kind of filling the gaps that have been left by larger NGOs um, and, and governments. I think every, everything that we read about um, the refugee crisis can often feel overwhelming and too huge for any single person to do anything meaningful to make a difference. So as well as the Choose Up Shop providing an absolutely essential way that we are able to provide support to people over the winter months as it gets really cold, um, also it, what we found is that it provides a really, really incredible, tangible way for people to help. Um, the way we set out the store is into three sections. We've got arrival, shelter and future. It kind of alludes to the journey of the refugee. Um, the arrival items, they're much more emergency items. It's things people need to keep them safe, like now, straight away. So we've got things such as hot meals, we put money towards our search and rescue teams, children's coats, emergency blankets. And then moving on to the shelter section, we have things such as tents, sleeping bags, hygiene kits, hot shower charities. Um, so really to keep people going and surviving. And then the future section, it's all items to do with the long term. So women's support, mental health support, having phone and top up, um, legal advice, um, well, school bag and um, school kit. So one of the nicest things that I've witnessed, and it's happened a few times, is when young children come in and they've saved up all of their pocket money or they're coming to spend their birthday money. Usually they'll buy something for kids because they're thinking, yeah, there are other kids out there this winter who are not going to be in the same situation that they're going to be and they want to do their little bit to help them. And so that is just so touching. Just, it's just simple. It's not political. It's just love.